ಬಂದೇಹಂ What happens is that a person gets so much involved that at the end of life, how are they going to switch gear? It's a, it's a, it's a cheating of Maya. That is that people say, that, okay, what happens is that you may be in first gear or second gear and uh, through the Grihatsu life, that's for some people. And then as your children get older, get married, then you can go third gear. Right? Maybe you're, you're older, you should go into fourth gear. But if you want to start out at 80 years old in the first gear, You're never going to get up to the fourth gear. You're never even going to get on. You, won't, you may not even have enough you know, momentum to get into the first gear. Some people at 80, they, they get an awakening, and they, I've seen old, some old people become Krishna conscious, even in Russia. But many people, it's not easy. They're, they're very much attached to their whole situation. They go visiting all the time, the children, one house to the next. That, They can't fix their mind uh, like that, uh, just in a spiritual life, for sure. And when they should go to the, by that time of life, they should be very wise people that can go and visit their, their children and give them spiritual guidance. But they're just themselves in the first grade. So you don't want to be 70 or 60 years old and start first grade of spiritual life. You want to go through your primary and secondary you know, already through your student and through your uh, married life. And then by the time you get to the retired life, you should be in a graduate or postgraduate level. And if you want to go faster during, you can also, but I'm saying the normal. Doesn't that sound more reasonable? <laughs> <laughs>